Hey, good morning. It's uh, day number something something. Today we're going on a little bit of adventure. We're going to the Grand, Grand Central Station. And we are going to take a train to Bath. Not to Mandila, but to this place called Bath. Lah. And with me is Jessica. As... Hi! So we've got no other friends. And she also got no other friends. Hey! Let's go, we're gonna meet Hui Ping back at the station. And then we're gonna go for this adventure together. <laughs> Alright, so we found Hui Ping. Hi! I haven't, so I haven't get a ticket for you yet. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah, let me just get a ticket. Lah. It's fine. Basically, if you want to take a train from here to Bath, it's about 57 uh, pounds. So, for Malaysia, you times 6. Ah. Yeah. So anyway, this is uh, my real tickets. They are real. Like, real. Okay, let's go to Bath. Let's go Mandi. Mandi. Alright, <laughs> morning. Oh, shit. Almost got crushed by the door. Right. So we're on the train ride to Bath Spa right now. And as you can see that I'm actually moving backwards because I wasn't like clear headed enough to get a chat and space to get away, so I'll be like traveling backwards for the next two and a half hours. And I might be vomiting into a bucket by the train man. Okay, so we just got off the train but we are still not in spa yet. Uh, we are in Bristol and we gotta take uh, another train to go to spa. Uh, I slept in the train and luckily I didn't vomit. Here departing from Bristol and heading towards Bath Spa and I thought the train is gonna move in this direction but nope we're moving backwards again the world is conspiring against me to puke into a bucket I, I enjoy talking to myself Jess okay don't judge me I enjoy talking to myself so here we are Bath Spa getting off the train so basically we're walking underneath uh, these umbrellas Huge umbrella road Yeah. Alright, I have no idea what's up with this town But there's like a lot of people and it's really really pretty This place is like freaking Maria man, look at this So eventful uh, Music, people, ice cream And there's like this guy who's playing uh, I mean, Huge bubbles Look at that Can you see that? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my god! Wow. <laughs> so basically there's a pigeon master. Wow. <laughs> there's a big pigeon of people. I don't know, is that, is that sanitary? In case you don't know, pigeons are the rats of the sky. Amazing, but kind of gross though. We're heading to the Roman bar. Yeah, okay, the whole reason why they call this place a uh, bar is because they are very famous for their bar houses back in the day. is about 15 pounds. We're in the bathhouse area. Uh, also known as the Roman side. Oh my god, look at this man. This is the bathhouse, water still green. 10,000 over years already, still green. Never changed water. So can you believe that like many many years ago, a bunch of naked people were in this water, bathing together. So now we're kind of like heading downstairs. More exhibition stuff in part here. Are you fascinated with these kind of things? Uh, yeah, I like the bar, but not the other exhibition stuff. <laughs> okay. Okay, so right here is like the uh, model of where we are inside right now. Uh, as you can see, that's the uh, this is the sacred spring. Definitely very sacred. This one is the this one is the uh, bar house, and this one is the temple. And this one is the polos. I have no idea what a polos. How I know? Yeah. So you can see that is the uh, the temple pediment according to this. It's basically the top part of the temple. Yeah, this one. And they are like filling it up. Yeah. So the some of the original part, then the rest is all digital. Yes, I'm a very good girl, right? Okay. Alright, so basically, yeah. we spend 15 pounds each. Yeah. We're gonna look at some rocks. I love rocks. 
Here, I'm gonna enjoy this rock, okay? Here we have some like uh, bone remains of um, yeah, of some people. Yeah, basically this is the reconstructed face. And um, apparently it's Jose Mourinho. Okay. Smell urea in chemistry lab? You smell urea. Yeah, urea. You actually smell urea. I do. Over here we have the head of Solis Minerva. Uh, basically, if you didn't tell me this is the head of Solis Minerva, I would think it's the head of Venus the Milo because everything looks the same. That one you cannot touch. This one. This one you can touch. Oh, Minerva. No. No, Indiana. We're looking at um, yeah, all the dead chilling. Oh. The dead, dead, dead chilling. So it turns out that people also throw some fake coins into the spring. Do you think your wishes will come true? If it's fake coins, I don't think it'll come true. So. There you get your there you get your fake wish. Uh. Okay, so amazingly enough, this is one of the more interesting locations of the entire exhibition. Is that you can see the water still runs in the bath. You can see some steam, some water running. Okay. I think it works for me today. So just now you see the water in the back there, it flows from there, from back there, all the way here. Basically, I'm showing you all Longkang. Ah. Actually, behind me is the swimming pool. Yep. <laughs> As you can see, still got a bit of water. Yep. They better clear it out. You know, like, if they're going to eat this. Coming out to the ground floor after walking in circles inside. This is the Roman bath. Actually, very crowded. Really, really crowded. So, we're really, 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 really close to the water. Yeah. Not supposed to put your hand in the water though. Can you see it's kind of ground. Uh, according to Jessica here, this one is all pandan water. So this one is the water, the flowing. You can see it flow from here, from the inside just now you see. And then it flows all the way out here. So from brown water become green water. Gula Melaka to air pandan. As you can see the water, this water thing is actually very dirty. Uh, it's untreated, not safe to drink or even touch. And I just now saw one little kid touching the water. So I bet he's gonna die. Yeah. So we reached the point of the tour that we all really want to try. This is the free spa water you can try. So I'm gonna try some untreated, not actually treated ones. Quite warm actually. Oh, so much minerals. <laughs> Jazz and Hui Ping is gonna try this uh, free spa water. And you guys gonna give me your, your honest review, huh? Okay, come, come. What is this man? It's not wine. <laughs> okay, drink, drink. <laughs> Basically, when I drank the water, it's not. Um, Hui Ping say it tastes like longkang water. Jazz just says you because there's a lot of things inside. Look at that. Sulfate la, calcium la, chloride la, sodium bicarbonate, magnesium, silica, potassium, chloride, chloride. Basically, we just drank the whole of about two caves. Oh okay, so we're done with the bath house. Pretty amazing stuff. Uh, I feel a bit smarter la, when I go in, but I know I talk a lot of nonsense. But I also learn the new things, la, so I don't feel so stupid. But it's pretty cool. Water tastes horrible though. We are now wandering around the city of Bath. Uh, they have this uh, crazy ass uh, flood protection scheme. I don't know how it protects from the flood, but apparently it does. Are you sick of me yet? Yeah? You're alright. And now we are at the Royal Crescent. Look at that. That's the view. Uh. Yeah, hey, this place is damn pretty. La. Look at this. Making out? <laughs> Making art. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay, so we've decided to take a walk into this large green place. Is it time to play the sound of music? <laughs> oh, Ernest, you have to sing the sound of music, right? Yeah, you can sing. Oh, wow, the Ernest. Is... come alive. The sound of music. <laughs> so, this is the Royal Crescent. And we're now in the grass field. Check it out. Yeah. Very nice. See, so can you see people just they're lying down? Yeah, they're not dead. They're just lying down. 
just uh, having good time. So you're gonna sit on the grass, just make sure there's no dog shit. Now, now we're sitting, there's no dog shit. I don't know how people lie down, because if I lie down, the, the sun is like, the sun... <laughs> Alright, so basically we're done with bath. We're done with our bath. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna head home now. You guys can see they're like very satisfied. I'm yeah. supposed to say something. No, you're not supposed to say anything. Oh, I'm just supposed to agree with you. I don't understand. You're supposed to agree with me all the time. That's not, that's not weird. I guess this is the end of our bath journey. This is the end of our bath. <laughs> I'm gonna start doing that stupid joke. Okay, just like that, we are done with the trip in bath. And now I'm on a train back on my way back to Birmingham. Uh, it was lovely because we gotta give a quick shout out to uh, Travel Recommends that provided me with this like, cute little white pad thing. So um, everywhere I go, I'm always connected. So I can always post pictures like, and spam people. So anyway, uh, I guess this is the end of the UK trip for this time around. Hopefully I can come back again and go on more adventures. Yeah, so don't forget.